Hello guys, Rob here. By request from the HODL EOS community, I am going to be starting off the How to Rex videos with the Grey Mass EOS Voter Wallet. So the latest releases of the Grey Mass EOS Voter Wallet have introduced a Rex portal so we can Rex our EOS tokens right from within the Grey Mass EOS Voter Wallet. You will only be able to do this if you do have the latest release of Grey Mass Wallet. So if you haven't got that already, you will need to come to the Grey Mass Wallet GitHub page and download the latest release, which right now is 0.7.8. And if you're on Linux, choose a Linux link. Mac, choose a Mac link. Windows, choose a Windows link. Just like you would when updating Grey Mass EOS Voter Wallet anytime. Select which machine you have and download the latest version and install it. So, once you have the latest version, as I do, 0.7.8, here we are inside of the Grey Mass Wallet. And the first thing I want to cover is just the tokens I have right now in this wallet. So, I have 1.9 EOS Liquid and 2.4 EOS that are already staked. And in order to rex these tokens through the wallet, we need to come to the Tools section. And in the tool section over here on the left hand side, you will see Rex Exchange Leasing. That is where we need to go. And from here, we can Rex our tokens. Now, there's two options up here at the top Deposit Rex and Exchange Rex. So, here on the Exchange Rex tab, you can see your EOS balances. Available EOS in Rex Smart Contract is showing zero. This row here is for Liquid EOS. Now for Liquid EOS, before they can be exchanged for Rex tokens, they do have to be sent to the Rex contract itself. Whereas with EOS you already have staked in CPU and EOS you already have staked in net can automatically be transferred into Rex tokens. So in order to get my Liquid balance into the Rex smart contract, I come over to the Deposit Rex tab here. And here it shows your Liquid balance, the amount of EOS that are liquid in your wallet right now that you can deposit into the Rex smart contract. So type a transaction here, deposit funds, withdrawal funds. We want deposit funds to deposit our funds into the Rex smart contract. I'm just going to move one EOS over, click deposit funds. This will deposit one EOS into the Rex smart contract. Okay, that's what I want. Confirmed. So now this top line here should show one once we go back over to exchange Rex, and there it is so that one eos i just sent over on the deposit rex page and it decreased my liquid balance to 0.9 and, and now have one eos in contract that can be withdrawn that is this one eos now available in the rex smart contract that can be converted into rex tokens so if i want to move this EOS here or any EOS I have that are in the smart contract but not staked not my staked balance in CPU not my staked balance in net this is where we would choose buy Rex I'm gonna move that one EOS into Rex tokens so my current balance is 57,890 once I buy Rex here that will increase purchase Rex with one EOS to confirm so we'll see the Rex balance increase. Rex balance increased to 67,887 and that EOS is no longer available in the Rex smart contract because it is in Rex tokens now. So that first step here depositing Rex only needs to be done for liquid EOS. For EOS you already have staked in CPU and EOS you already have staked in net, you can automatically exchange those into Rex tokens without going through the deposit Rex step. And in order to do that, you come down here on the exchange Rex page. And instead of buying Rex, we're going to buy Rex with staked EOS CPU. So for that one, I'm going to move over another one EOS. So since we're buying Rex with staked EOS CPU, that'll take one EOS out of this column here and put it into Rex tokens. So I'm going to click buy. You're about to change one EOS from CPU to Rex. Yes, that is what I want. Click confirm. Transaction goes through. We'll move up from 67,000 to 77,000 there. And that 1.5 EOS I had in staked CPU goes down to 0.5 because I moved one EOS over 
from my CPU staked balance into Rex tokens. The same thing can be done for EOS staked in net. So you come down here and click buy Rex with staked EOS, EOS net. And I'm going to move over 0.5 from there. If you put in a number larger than the available balance, it will tell you insufficient available balance. So you won't send a transaction with more than the available EOS you have. So I'm going to move over 0.5 EOS out of my EOS staked to net. EOS staked to net. Click buy. Confirm that. That will drop me down to 0.4 here and increase this EOS Rex balance to 82,000. There we go. Down to 0.4. There we go. So that is how you move your EOS into Rex in the gray mass EOS voter wallet. Now all those EOS I just moved over into Rex, it does take four days to mature. So I will not be able to move these Rex tokens back into EOS for another four days. So just keep that in mind. It's like staking. You know, with staking, you have that three day period. With Rex, there's a four day maturing period before anything can be done with these Rex tokens. And once these Rex tokens are mature, and I do want to move them back into EOS. I would just come here to the sell Rex section under the exchange Rex here. Go to sell Rex and put in the amount of Rex I want to sell and sell those. Now my entire balance should be still maturing. So even if I put one in here, insufficient available matured balance to complete transaction. Rex balances must mature for approximately four days before transactions may be created to sell. So since all of the Rex tokens I have are still maturing, it gives you this warning saying, hey, you can't sell those Rex yet. They are still maturing. So once they are mature, I would come in here and put in however many I wanted to sell that were mature and then click sell to sell those back into EOS. And then from there, once those Rex tokens are moved back into EOS, you come back over to the deposit page to withdraw funds because those EOS will go to the Rex contract and not into your wallet, I believe. Um, I have not had tokens fully mature yet, so I haven't done this process myself, but my understanding is that they will go back into the EOS Rex smart contract, and from there you'd have to come to the deposit page here, click withdra withdraw funds, and it'll show you the amount of EOS you can withdraw, put in the amount of EOS you wanna withdraw, and then once you hit withdraw funds, those EOS will be back into your EOS wallet. So there you go, guys. That is how you Rex on the Gray Mass EOS Voter Wallet. Again, it's under the Tools section. You come to Rex Exchange Leasing, and everything can be done from that page, either on the Deposit Rex tab or the Exchange Rex tab. If you do have any questions, you can pop them down into the comments below. But if you did enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. And I will see you guys in the next one.